हैं on that telegram bismillah ar-rahman ar-rahim ikhwati fillah hayakum allah allah yubarik fikum ya'am allah yubarik fik mashallah alhamdulillah thanks y'all inform me that the camera is on I don't know everybody seeing my big head, my big nose. Love it. <laughs> but um, today we're going to uh, we're going to need the dough. Today we're going to need the dough. Uh -huh. I'm going to give a, I'm going to give a sentence, and you have to conjugate it. I'm going to give a, a sentence, and you got to conjugate it. Uh -huh. So your brothers on, and sisters online. You have the opportunity to conjugate each one. Um, and the ones that hear, when your turn comes, you conjugate it. Uh -uh. Tell you, inshallah. Allah. Huh? Oh, we're not going to do it outside. Tell you, brothers and sisters, Allah, and you all are ready? Oh, let me tell you what we have. We have Hua, Hia, Ana, Anta, Anti, Nahnu, Hum. Naam, how many of that? Seven. Hua, Hia, Ana, Anta. Those are the first that we took. Now, after that, we have Anti, Nahnu, Hum. Taib, you're gonna conjugate these sentences to that. Taib ya Harun, who was jealous at ma abihi fil gurfa. Who was jealous at ma abihi fil gurfa. Who was jealous at ma abihi fil gurfa. Ma abihi. Nah, nah. Nah. So listen up. Let me say it now. We got it. Who are jealous? Ma abihi fil gorfa. Who are jealous? Keep that together. And I jealous too. Keep that together. He are jealous. Keep that together. Don't say he are jealous. No, I'm not accepting it. That's not acceptable. That's not acceptable. Ma Abihi, no, ma abihi, ma abi, ma abika, ma abihi, ma abiha, ma abihim, ma abina. You have to put it together. Just be quiet. <laughs> Just be quiet until you put those two things together. No, say ma abihu. Come on, you can do better than that. No, um, so that part there, you're gonna say ma abihi, ma abiha, ma abi. Ma abika, ma abiki, ma abina, ma abihim. Naam. Fil gorfa. You're not going to say fi. Fil gorfa. And this is not allowed. You all are with us. Try up. Try up. Let's go back to the beginning. Take your time. That's the, the point is that you take your time, but this is what part of articulation is is that you express expressions. Statements, not just words. Who was jealous at my abihi fil warfa? Who was jealous at my abihi fil warfa? He is jealous at my. He is jealous at. Ah, he is jealous at my. Okay, but don't say ma'a until abiha is with you in your mind. Again, here. Again. Tie up. And then the last two. Uh, 
انا جلست مع ابي في الغرفه Okay, get this together. مع أبي. Have right in your mind. مع أبي. Ma'am. At this point, مع is مضاف, and that which comes after it is going to be مضاف إليه. There's no مع that can just stand in the middle. If I said, who are jealous of مع? Like, I left you hanging if I just said, who are jealous of مع? You like waiting. Something has to be attached to مع. Something has to be attached to it. That means with it. So you want to keep it together. Who are jealous of? Stop there. Ma'a abihi. He are jealous of. Ma'a abiha. Until fi ana. Ana? Ana jealousy ma'a. Ana? Ana? Ana jealousy to. Okay, good, good, good. Enter Jalesta again, again. Enter Jalesta Ma'a Fil Amun. Enter Jalesta Ma'a Abiha Abiki. Enter, enter, now Abiki. Okay, again, we're going to do that one again. Enter. Anta <laughs> Good, good. Um, Jalasu Um, Jalasu Ma'a. Don't start over, just stop at Um, Jalasu, just stop there. Don't go anywhere until you put those two things together. Hum jalasu ma'a abina. Hum, hum. Abihum. Abihim. Abihim. Abihim fil ghurfa. Again, hum. Hum jalasu jalasu ma'a. Hum jalasu. Ma'a. I be nah. So that yeah, you gotta work on that part there. I'm gonna take that part when you get home. My Abi, my Abika, my Abi, my Abiha, my Abi. And the Gia Dawood, who are Gassala, my Labisa, who fis Sabah. Who are Gassala, my Labisa, who fis Sabah. Huwa, it's going to be the same one. Read the same sentence. Huwa ghasala malabisahu. Malabisahu fis sabah. Huwa ghasala. Malabisahu. Huwa ghasala malabisahu fis sabah. Hiya ghasala. Hiya ghasala. Malabisaha fis sabah. Anna Valestu. Anna Malabisaki, 
Gasado. 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 Good. 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 And the ya. Sanusi. Huwa akhadha aqlamahu min haqibatihi. Okay, we have two uh we have two the men muttasil, two words have the men. Huwa akhadha aqlamahu min haqibatihi. Huwa akhadha aqlamahu min haqibatihi. Good, good, good. Anti Akhasti Akalamiki Akalamaki Akalamaki in Akibatiki. Tie up, tie up. Anta Anta Akhada Anta Anta Akhasta Akalamika Akalamaka Akalamaka in Akibatika. Tie up. The word is Akalam. Min Hakiba. Min Hakiba. So we're on whom? No? No. So Akalamuna is um is the plural of Akalam? Well, we started from the from the book. Well, which one you on? Nahnu? Nahnu. Nahnu? Akadna. Akadna Akalamuna. Akalamana. Akalamuna. Min Akiba Tina. Yeah. Whom? Whom? Whom Akazu? Akalamahum. Akalamahum. Min Akibatihim. Min Akibatihim. Tayyab, yeah, where we at? Indic. Oh, we're right here. Hua Masha ila Baitihi Ba'ad al Khutba. Hua Masha ila Baitihi Ba'ad al Khutba. Hua Masha ila Baitihi Ba'ad al Khutba. I don't. Let's, let's go back to the beginning. Don't elongate. Ila beiti. Don't say ila beiti. Don't elongate that uh, ila. Here, here, Masat. Ila beiti ha ba'd al khutbah. Ana mashaytu. Ana mashaytu. Ila beiti ba'd al khutbah. Anta. أنت مشيت إلى بيتك بعد الخطبة. أنت مشيت إلى بع. أنت مشيت إلى بيتك بعد الخطبة. نحن مشينا إلى بيتنا بعد الخطبة. Hum Mashao Ila Bhadihim Ila Hum Hum Mashao Ila Baitihim 
بعد الكتبة نعم طيب طيب عندك يا عيسى هو كتب اسمه في دفتره هو كتب اسمه في دفتره هي كتبت اسمه هي كتب اسمها 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 هي كتبت اسمها في دفترها انت كتب انت كتبت اسمك في دفترها انت كتبت انت كتبت اسمك في دفترك انا انا كتبت انا كتبت اسمي في دفتري نحن نحن كتبنا اسم اسماءنا 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 في دفاتر دفاترنا جود في دفاترنا جود دفاترنا وهم هم كتبوا أسماءهم في دفترهم في دفاترهم في دفاترهم في دفاترهم Now, brothers and sisters online, how are you all doing? How are you all doing? You hear all the sentences that are going through? Yes. Ah. Yes. We're on Yunus. Yunus, you have? Who are Rafa Asautahu Bil Quran? We're doing Huwa, Hiya, Ana, Anta. Those are the first that we have. Then Anti, Nahnu, Hum. هو رفع صوته بالقرآن. هو رفع صوته بالقرآن. هي رفعت صوتها بالقرآن. أنا رفعت صوتي بالقرآن. بال بال بالقرآن. أنت رفعت صوتك بالقرآن. نحن. أنت. That's good. That's good. Tayyip, we have to do that drill on a regular basis. Now, this is not from the book. This is not from the book. Everybody's doing it from the head. The sentences are not from the book. The sentences, I just made up the sentences. The sentences are not in the book. Uh, I called everybody just to read those sentences. If y'all want to write down these sentences, let me just give an example of the sentence that I just gave. The first one was, uh, Huwa jalasa ma'a abihi fil gurfa. هو جلس مع أبيه في الغرفة هو غسل ملابسه في الصباح هو غسل ملابسه في الصباح إلى آخره فاني in the class طيب now I want you all to listen this is a drill there's no right or wrong there's no right or wrong I'm going to read all these sentences to you just want you to open your ears that's all this first page has 19 cents. I'm just going to go one after the other. I'm not going to read it fast. I just want you to listen. One after, digest it. Listen, listen, understand. Diane, all this is just a listening exercise. Um, I just want you to listen and get used to listening. Um, Diane. الطلاب غسلوا وجوههم وأيديهم يا ريحانة هل غسلت الصحون يا ريحانة هل غسلت الصحون نحن غسلنا سيارة المدرس بعد الدرس نحن غسلنا سيارة المدرس بعد الدرس نحن أخذنا حقائبنا من الغرفة نحن أخذنا حقائبنا من الغرفة 
man akhadha kitabi man akhadha kitabi ya amina hal labisti hijabaki al jadid ams ya amina hal labisti hijabaki al jadid ams nahnu raja'na min al masjid ba'd as salah nahnu raja'na min al masjid ba'd as salah mata kharajta min al bayt al yawm ya abd ar rahim mata kharajta min al bayt al yawm ya abd ar rahim ana mashaytu ila al masjid wa ukhti mashat ila al bayt ana mashaytu ila al masjid wa ukhti mashat ila al bayt ayna wada'ta al miftah ya salam ayna wada'ta al miftah ya salam الى اين مشوا الى اين مشوا يا عائشه هل ركبت العافله مع والدك يا عائشه هل ركبت الحافله مع والدك المؤذن رفع صوته للاذان المؤذن رفع صوته للاذان نزل الولد من الشجرة نزل الولد من الشجرة المسلمون خرجوا من بيوتهم للصلاة المسلمون خرجوا من بيوتهم للصلاة يا زيد إلى أين ركبت الحافلة يا زيد إلى أين ركبت الحافلة أنا تكلمت مع الشيخ بعد الدرس أنا تكلمت مع الشيخ بعد الدرس لماذا فاطمة قامت وتكلمت في الدرس لماذا فاطمة قامت وتكلمت في الدرس نزل القرآن من الله نزل القرآن من الله Antum. How do you understand it? Dawood. Everything's clear? Uh, one second. Yeah, huh? Kip. 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 Kip means to write. Kip. 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 lesson I uh, yep Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim wa nahnu fi as-safha al-thalithata ashar ba'd al-mi'ah al-thalithata ashar ba'd al-mi'ah on page 113 al-dars al-thani ashar Dos number 12. Adas Athani Ashar. Dos number 12. Ma'a. Ma'a means with. Ma'a means with. This word ma'a is mudaf. Is mudaf. Whatever comes after it is mudaf ilay. Let me explain something to you. That mudaf ilay can also be mudaf. And has another mudaf ilay attached to it. So I could say. هو ذهب مع زيد مع زيد هو ذهب مع زيد so مع is مضاف زيد is مضاف إليه but I can say هو ذهب مع أخيه هو ذهب مع أخيه فمع is مضاف وأخي is مضاف إليه but also أخي is مضاف and the pronoun at the end أخيه is مضاف إليه As the sisters online, are you all with us? But the word ma'a, it needs a mudaf. It's not going to just be there by itself. Ma'a. It has to get attached to mudaf. But what is getting attached to mudaf? That could be mudaf ilay. It has to get attached to mudaf ilay. But that mudaf ilay could be in itself mudaf that's attached to something else. Uh-uh. Like a, that's an example. Let's read. And when we read the examples, things should become clear. 
Ma'a is going to be attached, barakalafikum, to 12 pronouns. Ma'a, ma'i, ma'ana, ma'aka, ma'aki, ma'akuma, ma'akum, ma'akun, ma'ahu, ma'aha, ma'ahuma, ma'ahum, ma'ahunna. Brothers and sisters online, how are we doing? This word means with. If I'm going too fast, let me know. Let me know if I'm going too fast. Yeah. But now we're going to read uh, some sentences. Some sentences, inshallah, they're going to clarify for us. Uh -uh. We have sentences on the right and sentences on the left. Okay. There's no line there, but there's sentences on the right that have ma'a with a noun. And the sentences on the left have ma'a with a pronoun. Okay, Taib, you all are after me. Ana jalas tu fit dars maat tulab. Ana jalas tu fit dars maahum. Huwa rakib al hafila ma asahibihi. هو ركب الحافلة معه. We're going to come back and we're going to translate. No, 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 nobody worry about anything. We're going to come back. We're going to translate. Uh -huh. Okay. Let's 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 go back because they said we're going a little too fast. This word ma'a. What does ma'a mean? With. It has to be attached to something. Zaydun Zahaba Ma'a. Zay went with, I can't stop there. Zaydun Zahaba Ma'a Muhammad. He went with Muhammad. Zahaba Ma'a Bihi. We went with his father. Ma'a. It has to be attached to something. It can be attached to a noun. Ma'a Zaydun with Zay. Or instead of using the noun, I can use the pronoun and say Ma'ahu. Ma'a. Ma'ahu. I can say with him. I can say ma'aha with her. I can say ma'aka with you. I can say ma'i with me. Huwa dhahaba ma'i. What does that mean? Huwa dhahaba ma'i. He went with me. Rakibtu ma'ahu. What does that mean? Rakibtu ma'ahu. I wrote with him. Rakibtu ma'ahu. Wallahu ma'asabirin. What does that mean? Allah is with the patience. Um, wallahu ma'asabirin. It has to be stats. That's why sabirin and not sabirun. This is mudafilin. It has to get a kasra. Or that was the equivalent to a kasra, which is a yeah. Understand it. Ayah. So now we have our lesson here is not just ma'a, that it means with. And that's what this, we're going to understand. And we're going to get it through our heads, that you can't learn Arabic from a vocabulary list. I just have a vocabulary list. Ma'a means with, and that's finished. No, how do you use it? If, 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 if Ma'a was on a vocabulary list, would you understand that it's a mudaf and has to be attached to something? You wouldn't understand that. So now we have these pronouns that it gets attached to. Can you say, who are they have Ma'a anta? Can't say that. Ma'aka. Can't say Ma'a anta. Who are they have Ma'a ana? That's not how you say that. That's very bad language. Ma'a ana. Ma'a antum. No, ma'akum. Say ma'a antum. Brother says online, you are with us. Okay. You have to put it with a Damir Muntasal. You can't put it with a Damir Muntasal. That's how Allah uses it in the Quran. Who are ma'akum? Ain't a kuntum. Who are ma'akum? Um, so we have these these pronouns that we're familiar with. We're familiar with pronouns. Our first two lessons of the whole book were in pronouns. Particularly the Mir Mutasal. We know this the sequence we're familiar with. Ma'i ma'ana. Ma'aka ma'aki. Ma'akum ma'akunna. Ma'ahu ma'aha, ma'ahuma, ma'ahum, ma'ahunna. 
Are you all with me? How are we doing? Ma'i is with me. Ma'ana is with us. Inna Allah ma'ana. Now what did uh, the Prophet say to Abu Bakr when they was in the when they were in the cave? Inna Allah ma'ana. Allah is with us. Allah is with us. How are we doing, brothers and sisters, online? Wow. Tell you. <clears throat> now we want to learn how to use this word. Now, um, the pronoun takes the place of the noun. Uh, so you never say, I was with Zaid, and I ate with Zaid, and I sat with Zaid, with Zaid, and Zaid, and Zaid. You'll say, ow. Oh. Yeah, that's how when you speak. You're going to mention the noun one time, and then the pronoun is going to take the place of the noun. You don't have to keep mentioning his name anymore. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. Right. So look, look, let's look at these sentences. You all repeat after me. Ana janastu fit darsi ma'at tulab. So pardon me. I don't want to translate these sentences. I, I just want to leave you where you're at. I want you to struggle a little bit, you know. I want you to figure it out on your own. And then I'm going to come back and see if they need some help. I'm not going to just translate it immediately. We're going to go through all these sentences. Nah. And this is easy. Nah, this is not, nothing new here. Nah. It's just this word ma'a is new. And it came in the previous story. Nah. It came in the previous story. Nah. What takallama ma'ahum qalilan. That came at the last sentence of the story. What takallama ma'ahum qalilan. So now we're going to take advantage, exploit this word now that it came in the story. We want to learn how to use it now. So what did we do here at this lesson? We stopped. We took a break from what? I didn't want to give you a new pronouns right away. Because we already did. Hua, hia, ana, and one thing by itself. The next lesson, I gave you a number three. A number three. Anti, nahnu, wahum. I don't want to go straight to another lesson. It's just another a group of pronouns. I'm going to change the topic. Give your mind like a break on that topic and just go to something else. Do something else. Now, -uh. are you all with me, brothers and sisters online? That's the only reason why we bring this here. We, 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 the word came in. Let's make a lesson out of this and its benefit. And then we'll come back to the verbs later. Now, -uh. tell you. So today you all are studying. Tomorrow you are teaching. You know, you have to know what's in the book. Why is it like this? Now, -uh. Damn. We're going to read. Ana Janastu, you all are repeating after me. Ana Janastu fit dars ma'atullah. Ana Janastu fit dars ma'ahum. Who are Rakibal Hafila ma'a sahibihi. Who are Rocky Balhafila Maahu? Al Atfal Jalasu Maa Umahati him. Al Aulad Jalasu Maahun. هل نزلت من الجبل مع زيد يا عفوا هل نزلت من الجبل مع زيد وعلي هل نزلت من الجبل مع زيد وعلي هل نزلت من الجبل معهما هل نزلت من الجبل معهما؟ نعم، معهما is not معهما is not معهما is معهما معهما صحيح كريمة قرأت القرآن مع مدرستها 
Terima Qara'atil Qur'an Ma'aha I'm sorry about the um, About the um, The book uh, Let me move the sentences down Okay So How are we doing? Everything is understood is there Anything that's not understood Any number We have one through five Everybody understands. Anybody needs any clarification, elucidation, explanation? No. Al atfal. No. What does atfal mean? Children. Tiflun is, is a small child. Tiflun is the singular. Tiflun. Wa atfal. No. Like an awlad, that's general. It could be up to 12 years old. Well, it. No. No. So Tiful is a small child. No. A child, small. No. It shows that it's small. No. I mean, it doesn't indicate that it's small. It could be a big boy, it could be a big girl. We really, you know, we mentioned that walid in the book of Allah means what? Boy and girl. That's the truth. That's what walid means in the Quran. Walid is means a child, offspring. No. But a custom of the people has come that wallet, when they use wallet, they mean boy. And girl, they mean bent. But really, if you want boy, you have to say ibn. And if you want girl, you say bent, and you just want child. But there's no problem with saying wallet to mean boy. Nah. And awlad means children. And the word awlad in the Quran means children. It doesn't mean sons. But like in abnaal. Wabanat, that doesn't mean sons. Abna and sons. Wabanat is girls and those are words that are in the Quran. Ummahatihim, good question. The plural for um is ummahat. No. Um is singular. Ummahat is plural. So you have ummahatihim, they're mothers. No. What's another word for mothers? It's in the Quran. Walidati, wal walidati yurbi'na awladahunna. Allah yazda al insan to baqara. Al walidat. Walid, walida is a mother. Now, when you put an extra aleph and ta, al walidat, the mothers. So you have two words for mothers. Walida for um. Walidat, ummahat. Now, how are we doing online? How are we doing? All right, we're going to move on. Look at this next page here. Uktub al jumal al atiyah kama fil mithal. Write the following sentences as it comes in example. Look at the example. Ana dhahabtu ma azaydin ila suq. Ana dhahabtu ma azaydin ila suq. I went with Zaid to the suq. I'm going to say, and I have to make a who in a soup. All right, close your books. Mashallah. <laughs> if you would have seen their faces when I said close the books, oh man. <laughs> you should have seen these brothers' faces. If looks could kill. When Mama Dan, I see. Hello, Mr. <laughs> Try it. So what do you have to do? You're gonna like I have my eye with uh it's some boy here. I'm not I have my eye with a noun. You're gonna say the same sentence with the pronoun. Okay. Try it out this boy. I not the have to my azaidan in a souk. I not have to mahu ila souk. I am, I am. Uh, oh, what, what, what are we doing again? Wait, 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 hold on. What are we doing? Is it repeating? No, we're going to change. Yeah, we're going to change it from ma'a tulab to ma'a hum. Or to ma'a hu. Oh, okay. Okay. Okay, okay I am. Yeah. Yusuf jalasa ma'a tulab. <clears throat> Uh, 
So instead of saying my love, you're going to put the appropriate pronoun there. The appropriate pronoun. Right. Yusuf jealous of my love, you're going to say. Yusuf jealous of my love. What does that mean? <laughs> what? <laughs> you mean what I'm saying? English? Yeah. Let, let, let's go back to you. Yeah, let me hear. I have to my Zaydin. I'm not going to mention it either. So. Ana dhahabtu ma'a Zaydin. Ana dhahabtu ma'a Zaydin. Ma'ahu. Ma'ahu, because Zaydin, that's who. Nah. I'm going to say ma'ahu. Okay, now we're on you. you... <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, now it's your turn. Nah. Yeah. Yusuf Jalasa ma'a Tullab. Yusuf Jalasa ma'ahu. Tullab. <laughs> Oh, the pronoun for Tula. Right. Okay. You have Sahur today? That's Yusuf, Jalasa, Mahu. Mahum. 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 Just sit here. We're going to bring you. Some bolsters and everything right after <laughs> my grip, okay? So I have your devil. Aisha Ghassalat al Malabis Ma'a Talibat. Ghassalat al Malabis. Good, now I'm sorry, say I it, that's good. Aisha غسلت الملابس مع الطالبات. Aisha غسلت ملابس مع أبي. نعم بس هي الملابس. الملابس مع أبي. مع أهلنا. نعم. Good. طيب يا ينس. أبو بكر دخل المدينة مع الرسول صلى الله عليه وسلم. Bakrin Dakala Medina. Ma Rasul. That was the pronoun for Rasul. Is it Ma'i? Is it Ma'ana? Is it Ma'aka? Is it Ma'aki? Is it Ma'ahu? Is it Ma'aha? Is it Ma'akum? Is it Ma'ana? طيب ابو بكر دخل المدينه مع الرسول مع الرسول صلى الله عليه وسلم ابو بكر دخل المدينه مع الرسول طيب now we want the pronoun ابو like he had he had انا ذهبت مع زيد said انا ذهبت معه he had Yusuf Jalsa Ma'a Tullab. He said, Yusuf Jalsa Ma'a Hum. Now we said, and he had, he ghasalat al malabis Ma'a Tullibat. He said, he ghasalat al malabis Ma'a Hunna. Can Ma'a Tullibat? And he said, Ma'a Hunna. Now we said, Abu Bakr dakhil al-Madina Ma'a Rasul. Ma'a Hu. Ma'a Hu. Allah, who are Ma'ahum, no. I just put ashabi. I just put that, 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 yeah, there just to, yeah, yeah, just to, to trick you up, you know. I just put that ashabi just to kind of trick you, but it's, it's plural. Ma'ahum. But this is online. Number two was ma'ahum. Because this is ma'atullah. Oh, not ma, ma, ma'ahu. I'm sorry. Ma'a rasul. Ma'ahu. 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 Ta'ayyab. 
تعالى يا عبد الصبور سفيان غسل السيارة مع عبد القوي ووكيع سفيان غسل السيارة مع عبد القوي ووكيع سفيان غسل السيارة معهما 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 طيب يا هارون الأولاد الأولاد قرأوا الكتاب مع المدرس ما شاء الله there's a brother in the class named Harun ما شاء الله الأولاد قرأوا الكتاب مع المدرس. الأولاد معه، أمي مع. اسمع هلا أنت الأولاد قرأوا الكتاب مع المدرس. الأولاد قرأوا مع الكتاب. Okay, let's get this. Let's try it again. Let's try it again. Al Aulad Kara Um Al. Was it my house? Did I listen to it again? Okay. No. Okay. Astaghfirullah. Astaghfirullah. Al Aulad Kara Um Al Kitab Ma Al Mudarris. It's amazing how I just forget it. Okay, listen, listen, listen. Look, what does it mean? Al Aulad Qara'u Al Kitab. Ma Al Mudarris. Al Aulad Qara'u Al Kitab. Min Al Mudarris. What's the class that we're doing? What? What class? What's the lesson that we're doing? Like, what's the topic? Moving to the Arabia. We're on Ma'a. Yeah, Ma'a. Okay, let's try it again. Al Aulad Qara'u Al Kitab Ma Al Mudarris. Al Aulad Qara'u Al Kitab Ma'ahu. Ma'ahu, no. So I did get it right. You just want to take me to the. No, you didn't read about the sentence. Yeah, whoever gives us a hard time in the class, he has to bring like a bucket of chicken or something like that. Something. Come on. <laughs> Tell you about this. We're gonna stop here. Look at your, look at your books. Open up your books. And then tomorrow's Wednesday. Tomorrow we get into a new story. Tomorrow's Wednesday, right? Okay. Look at the bottom page one fourteen. It says, "Ya ayyuhal Muslim, Allahu ma'ak, bi rahmatihi wa ilmihi walhamdulillah." قد درست الآن خيرا كثيرا هذا بفضل الله ما ما أنا هذا who's gonna translate that brothers and sisters online أيها المسلم الله معك برحمته وعلمه الحمد لله قد درست الآن خيرا كثيرا هذا بفضل الله أنا سيد الله ما تدع مين أيها المسلم الله معك برحمته وعلمه الله معك برحمته وعلمه where the brothers and sisters are nine now all muslim allah is with you and what page we're on 114 Allah is with you with his knowledge. Nah. Allah is with you. Bi rahmatihi wa bi ilmi. It says bi rahmatihi wa bi ilmi. Allah is with you with his mercy and his knowledge. Praise be to him. You have now studied very much. This is from the bounty of Allah. Good. Nah. And that is sahih. Allah is with us with his knowledge, with his mercy, now nah, with his protection. Nah. Tell you. 
But daras tal ad, did we use this word darasa from, from before? Yeah. Darasa didn't come. But daras tal ad, you have studied now. Darasta means you study. It's a new verb. But daras tal ad, qad means that it has happened. It's, it's over. But daras tal ad, khayran kathir. You have studied a lot. And in, re in reality, we have covered a lot. Twelve chapters, but each chapter we go through it totally. Have it before this class. So we want to stop here. We want to thank Allah. Tomorrow, look at this section here. You are want to con you want to uh, conjugate these sentences. Tomorrow, these words on page one fifteen. On page one fifteen, it says Anna. Right. Then you say Anna. It says Anna. Luma nahnu. Luma anta. Luma anti. Huwa here. Whom? I made the order different. Now is in the order of first person, second person, third person. Now, now we want to keep that order because we know our original order. Now, so that's how you want to go through the verb. I'm going to give you one a verb tomorrow, Gasala. You're going to say, Ana Gasaltu, Nahlu, Gasalna, Anta, Gasalta, Anti, Gasalti, Hu Gasala, Hia Gasalat, Hum Gasalu. I'm going to give you Akhada. You're going to say, Ana Akhatu. Nahnu akhavna, that's first person. Ana akhavtu, nahnu akhavna, that's first person. Or we call it al mutakallam, the mere mutakallam. Naam. Then you say, anta akhavta, anti akhavti. That's all we took from second person, which is the mere muqatab. That's all we took so far. Anta akhavta, anti akhavti. And then you say, huwa akhada, hi akhadat, hum akhadu. Let me give you another word like labisa. I'm going to say, Ana labistu, nahu labisna. That's the first person, the man of mutakallam. Anta, uh, we'll say labista. Anta labista, anti labisti. I know I'm probably going too fast, right, brothers? This is online. That's the first thing we're going to do tomorrow. And look at page 117. We have three new pronouns. Read ahead. Read ahead. You're not going to drown. Like, if you go ahead, you're going to drown. You don't have a, a lifeguard. You don't have a lifesaver with you. Nobody's there with you in the pool. Don't be afraid. Go ahead. Uh -huh. We have three new pronouns. Look at it. Look at the next page. Familiarize yourself with it. Uh -huh. This is where we're going tomorrow. You know, does the teacher have more enthusiasm for your class than you? I have more than you? It's your class. Yeah. Uh -huh. Okay. Uh -huh. So read ahead. Read the second page ahead, so that when we come tomorrow, you kind of familiarize with it a little bit. Now, tell you we're going to stop here, and tomorrow's going to be our last day for the week. I think this week was a good week. You know, I think this is a good week. Uh -huh. But then once we get, you, you know, you have to memorize the story, and it's not long, but you know where we're headed. You know. But then we look at after that, we're gonna have to knead the dough. Look at the sentences there. Same program. Same program. All right, we're gonna meet you tomorrow. You bring the uh bucket of chicken. Uh, you can bro. If it's raw, I don't need a bucket. <laughs> Right, we're going to stop here. So we're going to go on with the hummus. I don't know why I'm not into stuck when I go out to do it now.